Hey everyone, Griffin from GG Leagues here. We're excited to tell you about our rule change regarding Pro Draft, what it is, how to use it, and what to do if something unexpected happens. First, let me tell you about what Pro Draft is and why a team would want to use it for those of you who don't know what it is. Pro Draft is an online drafting tool that allows teams to simulate champion select as if they had access to all champions in the game. This allows both teams to draft in the fairest way possible as they will not be limited to which champions they can choose. Of course, Pro Draft is only a simulation, so keep in mind to only pick champions that your players own. Drafting through Pro Drafts simply allows champions to be picked in whatever order you need to without worrying about owning the champion. Next, if at least one team requests to use Pro Draft, it must be used for that game. That team that requests Pro Draft will create the Pro Draft lobby and share the links. If both teams requested Pro Draft, the team designated on the right side of the lobby, the red side, will create the Pro Draft. If neither team needs to use it, teams can draft in the in-game client as usual. Let's walk through a quick demo of Pro Draft. You can find Pro Draft at ProDraft.LeagueOfLegends.com. There, you can create a Pro Draft by filling out the appropriate fields. After that, you will see three links. Send the links to the appropriate persons. Once both teams click the Ready Check button, the draft will begin. Pick and ban as you would in the LOL client until the draft is complete. When you are done with the Pro Draft, go back to the League of Legends client and start the in-client draft as normal. As long as the picks and bans are the same, it does not matter what order your champions are picked in. For example, if you first pick Teemo in the Pro Draft, but it's for your support, your support can pick Teemo last. Auto locks of unintended picks or bans can occur in Pro Draft. Taking into consideration how the program works, please follow this protocol if an unintended pick or ban occurs. If a team is hovering a champion and the timer hits zero before a team is locked in the pick, the champion being hovered is locked in automatically. If no champion is being hovered and the timer hits zero before a team has locked in a pick, a random champion is locked in. In this case, alert the enemy team immediately and the pro draft must restart with the same picks and bans up to that point. If the next pick and ban is locked in before the team in error alerts their opponent, the erroneous selection will be finalized and the team in error must play out the game with that pick. If the team in error has attempted to notify the opponent about the mistake but has yet to get an acknowledgement of the situation, message a league manager on Discord to assess the situation and make a ruling. If the timer hits zero before a team has selected a champion to ban, this results in no ban. In this case, that team simply loses a ban. No restart will be issued or required. Any issues that occur during Pro Draft should be communicated to the other team via Discord, direct message, or through the League of Legends lobby chat. Please monitor these chats during Pro Draft to ensure any mistakes can be communicated in a timely manner. I hope this video helped you understand Pro Draft and our rules around it. As always, if there's any issues, please send a message in our help channel in our Discord and our friendly league managers will be able to help you out. Good luck this season and have fun.